can you tell me your name, where you're from, and your profession? My name is Oliver Müller. Uh, I'm a homeopath living in Germany. And uh, how was the experience of attending the seminar been for you? Um, I was attending a lot of seminars here. I do organize Brafel Wicek in Germany. So uh, this is the, the second practical training we have here in Mumbai. And this is a two weeks course. So within this two weeks, he really goes into the materia and it's a really advanced, deep teaching. And it's wonderful because here we really see what, what he's doing and we learn a lot from him. Uh, when you say advanced, is it different from what you would see anywhere else? The way he teaches or what he teaches? Yes, it's not, it's not dif different, but he goes deeper because here he has more time. Usually we have seminars in Germany, there is just three days seminar or maybe four days seminar. Here we are for ten days. And, um, but I won't say that he doesn't teach deep in other seminars, but here you can ask personally. We are a little group of 30 people and a big seminar there are in Germany, there are 200, 250 people sit, sitting there. So the intensity here is much more. And uh, how much of an impact has Dr. Prabhu Zekar had on your beliefs or on the way you practice homeopathy? I'm a homeopath since 26 years. And um, I got Dr. Vichekar known about nine years ago. And with his new view of homeopathy, uh, there was a, a drastic change. Uh, I have known that you can really uh, cure very deep diseases. I'm not talking of cancer. He cured even blind people who got eyesight back and crippled people and I haven't known that before. So, uh, and with this new side and the art or the, the knowledge doing it, it's changed a lot. Now my clinic is full with very deep-seated pathology like MS, like uh, neuro, neuro uh, motoric diseases like cancer and now I'm not afraid of these diseases now I know how to treat it and in general on the field of homeopathy what kind of impact has Dr. Prabhupada Vijayakar's work had? Um, he is very well known here in India as you know he is getting more and more known in, in Europe uh, he wasn't well known about 10 years ago but his books are very is, are getting famous, and now if there are seminars with homeopaths, usually they get 50 to 100 people coming. With him, we get 250 people coming on one seminar. So he's getting more and more well known, and um, uh, people really start to get curious about this guy who is treating very deep diseases, but. Um, who, who treat them really with, with respect and he, he can cure these uh, cases. So uh, when you say he's getting known in Europe, would you say his work is being recognized by uh, doctors in Europe and they're, they're recognizing his uh, way of working? He's, he, it depends. If people know him, he's very recognized. Uh, there are some people who don't like him, but they don't know him actually. You know, they think, what a crap, he's Indian, he's telling uh, stories. Nobody's gonna heal cancer with homeopathy. Nobody's gonna heal uh, deep-seated uh, diseases with homeopathy. But he shows that he's doing it. He has hundreds of videos. I'm in his clinic quite often, I see what happens. So, um, if people come and see what he's doing, Everybody's convinced. So, and with that, he's getting more important, and a lot of people say he's one of the best homeopaths we have nowadays, worldwide. And uh, why should people choose homeopathy as a form of medicine to find cure for their ailments? Uh, for me, homeopathy is. I don't know whether the only way for curing, but it's, it's the best way on one of the very um, seldom rare kind of, of healing method. Uh, the normally 
normal medicine cannot heal at all because they are just focused on the symptom. So they take off the symptom. It's like you drive a car, your oil light is burning and you take it off and throw it out of the window. That is what in the normal medicine happens. They don't see the human being in behind. They don't believe that the disease itself or the symptom matters in the life of the person and there is reason to, sh to come up. Uh, so it's very different between allopathy, the normal medicine, and homeopathy. And for me, homeopathy, the only way to get diseases cured, like asthma, rheumatism, whatever. In the normal medicine, you give remedies to keep it on a better level. You can uh, keep uh, like high blood pressure, you can keep it on a lower level, but only if you take blood pressure remedies all your life long. In homeopathy, we're going to cure this disease, so after a few months, you don't need anything and your blood pressure keeps low. So that is the big difference for me. Okay, that should be. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.